One of the big questions I have as we head into OTAs and training camp and eventually two months away preseason is what on earth are the Eagles going to do about Jalen Rager? I'm keeping this short, sweet, and simple. I want your thoughts on this as well because at this current state, I, 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 get, I get the situation and we've had plenty of situations before. I've gone through Car the Carson Wentz situation, which was a whole saga that stemmed for like two years. Uh, the Zach Ertz situation when uh, him and Howie were feuding and going at each other um, before his inevitable trade uh, in the 2021 uh, NFL season. But now we get this one, Jalen Rager. And it's a simple one, but an annoying one because this is a mistake. This player being on this roster at the at the the price tag that he's at right now is a complete mistake. And Howie Roseman knows this, and though he hasn't said it verbally, he's done plenty of things to under to to help us understand that he understands that he effed up, and that's trading for Zach Pascal or not trading, signing draft Pascal, getting Devonte Smith last uh, draft in 2021. And of course, the biggest one, trading a first round draft pick for A.J. Brown this past draft in the 2022 NFL draft. I mean, it's obvious what he's doing here, especially with the amount of potential that Quez Watkins brought to you last year when he was drafted way later than Jalen Rager. And knowing who we missed one pick after Rager in that draft in 2020, I mean, it's a no brainer. It's clear as day, but we know why we can't get rid of him or at least why we can't just cut him it'd be too big of a loss to our cap. And that's the thing. We did good at getting back to a, to a reasonable state when it came to our, our cap situation after the Carson Wentz trade uh, in 2021. Jalen Rager can screw things up for us, especially if we want to make more trades and signings that we just signed a corner. Uh, so I, I just, I can understand why the Eagles are a little hesitant unless if they can trade him. And that's another thing they had some teams calling for him during the draft, but nothing ended up happening. What do you guys think the Eagles should do with Rager? Because at this rate, in my mind, I don't think they're going to do anything with him. He's either going to be deactivated or he's going to be the fifth or sixth option that will come in for a potential injured player. That's about it. I don't see this man making any game time whatsoever. Maybe as a punt returner if we don't want to throw in uh, Boston Scott back there to struggle or Greg Ward to not do enough. Because our wide receiver room, A.J. Brown, Devontae, uh, I, keep, I almost say, I always say Devontae Adams. I'm so used to saying that. Devontae Smith, Zach Paschal, uh, Quez Watkins, and Greg Ward. Those five guys are more than enough for the Eagles this year. Jalen Rager fits nowhere in this puzzle. That's that. that.